Hey, what is going on guys? So you have a Pixel 1 or Pixel 2 or the XL version. I'm gonna show you several different ways to fix your phone if you have a black screen or if it's frozen or if it's in a boot loop or if it's unresponsive, okay? Now this is not gonna work for all of you, but I'm gonna guess 50% of you guys, one of these methods is gonna work or a combination of these methods. So if any of these methods work, please comment, like the video, and tell me which method worked or which combination of methods you think worked. And if it didn't work, give me a dislike so everybody can see, okay? So first thing is this. For those of you that have a black screen, what you wanna do first is go ahead and take off a case. If you have a case on there, go ahead and pry the case off. Also, if you have a uh, screen protector on there, Go ahead and take it off. If you don't want to take it off because you're going to ruin it, what you can do is go through all the steps. And if it didn't work, then go back and then go ahead and take off the and take off the screen protector and do it all over again. Okay. So no cases on here. It's purely naked. No screen protector. So first thing I want to do is make sure that the sensors aren't dirty or clogged or anything like that. Get yourself a paper towel. Dab a little bit of water on a paper towel, or just go and then clean up here a little bit. Okay. Okay. So the next thing we want to do is a force restart. Okay. Now let's just pretend that this phone is black. Okay. Obviously the phone is working, but let's pretend it's a black screen here, but I can still feel it vibrate or I may see some lights coming on here, meaning the phone is still on, it's still powered on. Okay. So what we do from here is press and hold the power button. Okay. Ready? One, two, three. I'm going to press and hold and I'm going to continue to hold until I see that Google animation pop up so don't let go you might have to wait a minute or so just keep holding it only the power button keep holding don't let go still too early now go ahead and let go and hopefully you see the screen and your phone will be back up and running now the thing is if you don't see this what you want to do now is do this okay go ahead and play with the power button because it could be an issue with your power button as well go ahead and press your power button in and out as fast as you can same thing with the volume blockers too. The two volume buttons, your phone might go crazy. You might hear a bunch of different stuff. Who cares? Just keep doing this. Trust me. Keep go ahead and pressing the power button again, just like that. Now go ahead and try the same thing again. Press and hold the power button. Don't let go and wait for it to um, show the Google animation. Then you can let go. Okay. You may have to wait one minute, two minutes, three minutes. You may have to try this four, five, six times. Okay. Just keep holding until, it until the phone boots back up into the uh, Google logo here, then you can let go. Now, if it's still not working, go ahead and do the same thing again. Press the power button in and out, fast as you can. Also the volume button. Now, I also want you to do this too. Go ahead and, and what I want you to do is press all over the screen, okay? You can get a paper towel or whatnot. Just press down a little bit firm, okay? Now remember, I'm not responsible if anything happens worse to your phone, okay? Just press everywhere on the phone with your thumbs. On the front screen like this, you just wanna keep doing this, give it a little bit of force, because it could be a, a, a connection issue too. Trust me, this sounds ridiculous, but just do it, okay? Press all around. Now I want you to go ahead and turn the phone over and do the same thing over here too. Go ahead and push all up here, even near the camera lens. Push all around there. Just keep pushing all the way down, all over. Now what I want you to do is go back and do the same exact steps again. Go ahead and press uh, the power button, press and hold, and hopefully you see that Google logo pop up. Now if it doesn't, the next thing I want you to do is go ahead and plug in your phone, wait about 10 minutes, give it some time to juice up a little bit more. After 10 minutes, I want you to do the same thing that we just did from the beginning of the video. Okay, start, you know, do the force restart, press and hold the power button. That doesn't work. Go ahead and play with the power button and the volume buttons. And then also, again, go ahead and press down on the screen all over. You may have to do that four, five, six times, okay? And keep doing these steps several times while it is plugged in and it is charging. Now, if it's still not working, I want you guys to do this. Go ahead and grab your phone while it's naked, put it into your freezer. Leave it in there for one hour, then take it out and do all the steps over again. I know it sounds ridiculous, but guys, just do it.
Now, if the freezer method doesn't work, then your only other option basically is to do a factory reset. The only thing is if you do a factory reset, you will lose all your data in the phone. It'll basically make your phone as if you just bought it and took it out of the box, okay? I don't recommend doing that way unless maybe you already have everything backed up on your phone via cloud or whatnot. Anyways, I'll show you how to do that. But again, I don't recommend it. And remember, if you do this last option here, you will lose all of your data. So in order to do a factory reset, we just have to go into the Android recovery mode. And how you do that basically is you press and hold the power button and the volume down rocker, okay? Only two buttons, okay? So power button, volume down button, okay? One, two, three, press and hold. And I'm gonna continue to hold both buttons. Pretend the screen is black. Don't worry about what's going on in there. Just keep holding it, keep holding it. Just, okay. And then you get to this, this um, Android bot here. And then from here, here with the volume rockers, we can go down or up. If we go down, it changes up here. You can see that it's on uh, restart bootloader, download mode, recovery mode, barcodes, power off. Okay, so we're gonna go down to recovery mode right here. To select it, you simply press on the power button. Give this a second to boot back up. All right, so now you should see the uh, no command down here with the dead robot. So from here, what you need to do is press and hold the power button and then press the volume but button up once, okay? So again, press and hold power button, press the volume up once, and then let go. And then you are into this menu here, the Android recovery mode here. Now from here, if I wanna scroll down, I would use the volume rocker. So if I use the volume down button here, we'll move from reboot system now, all the way down to, it says here, white data factory reset. Now remember, you will lose everything on your phone if you do this method. I don't recommend doing it this way, okay? Anyways, to confirm, you would press the power button. Press the power button here, and then right here, they give you another menu here, basically saying, are you sure you wanna do a factory reset? You will lose everything on this phone. And then you can go ahead and select no or yes. If you wanted to go ahead and proceed, you would select on yes, you would use the volume down rocker, go to yes, and then click on the power button to confirm. However, I'm not doing this to this phone. I'm gonna go back up to where it says no, and I'm gonna go ahead and click on the power button, and then I'm gonna go ahead and click on the power bu button again so I can reboot system now so I'm back into normal mode, okay? Anyways, guys, let me know which option, which method, which combination of method you think worked for you. Give me a thumbs up if it worked for you, and if it didn't work for you guys, Make sure you give me a thumbs down so everybody else can see as well. Anyways, this goes for the uh, Pixel 1 and the Pixel 2 as well as the Pixel uh, 1 and 2 XL. I hope that helped you guys out. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next.